Microsoft just dropped an open source agent framework. OpenAI fired back with Agent Kid at Dev Day. And honestly, this is the biggest AI battle of 2025. I'm going to show you both platforms live. You'll see real demos, actual code, and which one wins. One is open source with crazy multi-agent orchestration. The other has drag and drop builders and works inside ChatGPT. By the end, you'll know exactly which one to use. And I'm going to save you weeks of research. This is wild, so let's go. Okay, so first, what even is an AI agent? An agent is basically an LLM with superpowers. It's not just answering questions. It can take actions. It can use tools. It has memory. ChatGPT answers your question. An agent books your meeting, sends the email, and updates your calendar. That's the difference. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency, Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below which platform you pick. Microsoft's agent framework is open source. It's an SDK and runtime, Python or .NET, built for multi-agent orchestration. Multiple agents working together, one researches, one writes, one fact checks. It integrates with VS Code and Azure. You host it yourself, you control everything. This is for developers who want power and flexibility. OpenAI's agent kit is the opposite. Visual toolkit, drag and drop agent builder, chat kit for embedding agents, connector registry for Gmail calendars, databases. It's managed, it's hosted, it's turnkey. This is for product teams who need to move fast without infrastructure hassle. Quick comparison. Microsoft Agent Framework Open Source, Python and .NET, Multi-Agent Orchestration, VS Code Integration. You run it locally or deploy on containers for developers who want control and no vendor lock-in. OpenAI Agent Kit, Visual Builder, Drag and Drop, Chat Kit Embedding, Pre-Built Connectors, Hosted Runtime, Chat GPT Integration. For product teams and startups who want to prototype fast, Microsoft's Agent Framework has three pieces. The SDK on GitHub, the runtime and the orchestration engine. You install it with pip or NuGet, define agents, tools, and workflows. The orchestration is where it gets wild, sequential workflows, group chat where agents debate, magentic workflows that adapt. This is teams of agents working together. The VS Code integration is killer. Build, test, and debug right in your editor. Graph visualization, see agent connections, step through calls like debugging code, the quick start from Microsoft Learn shows a research agent, clone the repo, install, write Python, create agent, define tools, it searches, reads, summarizes, chain multiple agents, one researches, one writes, one fact checks. All happening locally, no platform lock-in. Because it's open source, you customize everything, swap LLMs, add custom tools, deploy anywhere, that's the power. But it comes with complexity. You're writing code, managing infrastructure, this is not for everyone. OpenAI announced Agent Kit at Dev Day. The agent builder is visual, drag and drop tools, configure prompts, test in real time, ship to production without much code. ChatKit is an SDK for embedding agents in your app. Add a few lines, users get an AI agent. The connector registry has Gmail, Google Calendar, Slack databases, just plug them in. The idea is speed. Product teams don't want weeks building infrastructure, they wanna ship fast. Let me show you agent builder, create new agent name it, add tools, building customer support, add Gmail connector, agent reads and sends emails, add calendar, it schedules meetings, add knowledge base, it answers from your docs, all drag and drop, test live, deploy, open a, host it, embed with chat kit, done. And hey, if you're serious about scaling with AI, you need to join my AI profit boardroom right now. This is the best place to scale your business, get more customers and save hundreds of hours with AI automation. Inside the boardroom, you'll get access to proven strategies that are working right now. Real case studies from entrepreneurs making money with AI, a community of people just like you who are building and scaling with AI. You'll learn exactly how to implement AI in your business without wasting time or money. The link is in the description below. Don't wait on this. AI is moving faster than ever. And if you're not automating, you're literally falling behind your competition every single day. Let's talk security. Agents are powerful, but risky. They access tools, read emails, execute code, move data, massive attack surface, first connectors. Every tool is a vulnerability. Agent accesses Gmail, could leak emails, need permissions, audit logs, sandboxing, second tool execution. Agents call APIs. Misconfigured API could delete data or expose secrets, need rate limits, error handling. Third, data flows. Where's it stored? Who accesses it? Is it encrypted? Microsoft gives you full control. You host the runtime, configure permissions, set up audit logs. You're responsible. 
OpenAI offers managed security, they handle hosting, built-in rate limits and logging, but you're trusting their platform. Best practices include least privilege access, audit logs for every tool call, sandboxing and rate limits. Both platforms support these, but you implement them. Use cases, Microsoft is perfect for multi-agent pipelines, research tool, agent search, read, summarize, generate reports, group chat orchestration, agents collaborate, enterprise automation, pull data from internal systems, analyze, trigger actions, you control everything, no vendor lock-in. OpenAI is perfect for product embedded agents, SaaS app, one AI assistant for users, build-in visual builder, embed chat kit, done, rapid prototyping, test ideas fast, build, test, deploy in a day, no code, no infrastructure. Here's the hybrid. Use Microsoft's framework for orchestration, call OpenAI models as tools, control of Microsoft, power of OpenAI's LLMs, define agents in Python, use orchestration, LLM backend is GPT-4, best of both worlds. That's what I'd recommend for serious projects. Which one should you pick? Need open source control and multi-agent orchestration? Microsoft, want full customization and okay managing infrastructure? Microsoft, building complex enterprise automation Microsoft, need product velocity and managed connectors? OpenAI, want to prototype fast and ship without infrastructure? OpenAI, product team embedding agents in consumer API, OpenAI, both are powerful, different developers. This battle matters, agents are the next wave. Moving from chat to autonomous systems, agents do work for you, automate tasks, make decisions, Whoever wins controls the developer ecosystem. Microsoft bets on open source and control. OpenAI bets on managed platforms and speed. Both will succeed. There's room for both. But pick the right tool for your needs. Resources. Microsoft's agent framework is on GitHub. Docs on Microsoft Learn. Quick start samples use Azure. OpenAI's agent kit announcement covers agent builder, chat kit, connectors, security commentary on attack surface. And hey, if you're serious about scaling with AI, join my AI Profit Boardroom. Best place to scale your business, get more customers, save hundreds with AI automation, access to proven strategies, case studies, entrepreneur community, link in description. AI is moving fast. If you're not automating, you're falling behind. Also, if you want to make more money with AI, welcome to the free AI Money Lab with Julian Goldie. This is completely free and packed with value. Inside, you'll get 50 supply of free AI tools that you can start using today. Time dribblers, chat GPT, SEO prompts that are proven to work. You'll learn exactly how to make money with AI agents step by step. You'll get access to 1,000 plus free NAN workflows that you can copy and are using your business right now. And you'll get a full blueprint to generate thousands of leads completely free with AI. No paid ads, no expensive tools, just AI doing the work for you. This is all free. The link is in the description. Join the AI Money Lab right now. Don't wait. That's it. Microsoft's agent framework versus OpenAI's agent kit. Both powerful, both changing the game. Now you know which to pick need control and orchestration, Microsoft. Need speed and managed platform, OpenAI, hybrid approach is killer too. Use both, get best of both worlds. Let me know in comments which you'll try. Julian Goldie reads every comment, drop your thoughts. If you got value, smash like and subscribe. AI updates every week. See you in the next one.